Okay, I happened to come across this video of Derek Jackson. Um, I've seen three or four of his videos before, um, I think at the beginning of when he started his channel and it was giving me, um, pandering vibes. It was <laughs> giving me, it was giving me a type of energy that is saying that you really are not practicing what you preach I don't believe it it's just not coming across to me as believable and lo and behold it wasn't believable <laughs> because he was talking about you know what women want you know men making excuses and at this point a lot of men especially red pill men but a lot of men just was rolling in joy and happiness when they found out that Derek Jackson was the same scumbag as them. Imagine having a daughter, having a mother, having a sister, and you're happy that the next man who could meet one of your female family members is a dusty scumbag like yourself. You don't want anybody to be better or do better. It's insane to me. Like people don't sit down and critically think anymore that they would really sit up here and be happy that a man is hurting his spouse, that not only is it hurting his spouse, it's hurting his children. You think that this energy isn't going to affect those children? Do you really think that, you know, any family members around or friends that that doesn't affect them? Like you are happy that somebody is a piece of shit. And when you cheat, look, Men can talk about how they want all this vagina. They can talk about how they can lay down in a bed and have sex and not create soul ties and have any emotion behind it. That's a lie. That is such a lie. That's why they die before women, because they are always trying to portray this character that they have been fed of what a man is and what a man should be and how a man really reigns in his emotions and women are emotional like they're not a fucking human being with emotions and they, they do. They get illnesses and they die. Um, earlier than women because you're holding all that in you're trying to pretend like you're this tough dude man he is it's just bits and pieces from here and there you're trying to piece together and if dad is not there that makes it 10 times worse um, if a positive male figure is not there even if if dad is there that doesn't mean he's positive and um, it makes it 10 times worse as well this whole thing about you're choosing wrong, you're choosing Pookie and Ray Ray. You knew he was dusty. Now, when when we talk about Sierra and future, she she saw that goddamn dust storm and she thought that she could change it. She thought, you know, with her ladylike demeanor and everything that it would just clear the dust up. It just, no, no, she got tangled up in the dust and she had to take some time so she could get those dust particles out of her hair and off of her so she could go to a real man like the man she's married to now Russell Wilson now this just sent me through the roof the fact that he would make a reaction video reacting to a video with him and his wife that's what this is. He is literally giving a speech of he sit in his car. He watched the video of that he had his wife do. Them sitting there after the whole um, entanglement that he was in with several women and the things that he did to his wife. Basically, he was reacting like, you know, the energy, she looks like she doesn't want to be there. She, it, the, the smile is, looks fake, you know, it, it does. She is like, she wants to go off. He looks like he's lording over her to do this.
And, you know, I believe she did it because uh, she's a Christian. And damn it, Christianity is it's a hell of a drug. It really is. It's a hell of a drug. And it has people just doing all kinds of crazy shit, thinking all types of crazy shit. And please understand, I do not equate the Bible with Christianity. Because if you look at the two, you can see that it has nothing to do with the biblical text. Nothing about that religion has anything to do with the Bible. But it's just, you know, you could tell she was uncomfortable. You can tell that there was a mental breakdown with her and this was affecting her mentally and spiritually um, by a series of videos that she did. She's trying to be the ride or die chick. She's trying to overcome the anger and the hurt and the pain. She's, you know, she's doing that old black woman shuffle. That's, that's what it is. You know, you struggle, love. I'm going to love him through it. Even one of my fam female family members, when she was talking to a woman and, um, it was the wife of a pastor. That's the advice she gave her. Just, you know, he's going to knock your fucking skull out of your skin. Basically, that's what he's doing. Love him through it. Just, yeah. And that's what she is doing with Derek Jackson. But the nerve of this nickel to sit here and react to his own video on a subject of he was in an entanglement with women. This shows that he's a piece of shit. This shows that she needs to get away from him and she could do better. I get abuser vibes from him. That's my opinion. And I believe that he picked her because he knew because of her background. Um, she came from a foster home that she wanted stability. She wanted children. She wanted a family. She wanted to be this beautiful Christian family with a white picket fence with a husband that was faithful and who loved her with her children and she's doing her wifely duties and making sure she's being a good housewife pleasing her husband taking care of the children nothing wrong with that I love to see it when it's healthy um and that's what she wanted because of her background and he knew he could get away with what he was doing and that she would actually forgive him because of what she wanted and the fear of her past. He's a predator. We can slap super predator on him because he's preying on someone in the community. But yeah, I hadn't seen this. I just was floored when I saw it. The nerve of this ninja the nerve i'll go ahead and leave it right here let me know what you think did you see the whole thing did you listen to the whole thing what do you think about Derek jackson making a reaction to himself within this situation of his entanglement comment like subscribe and i'll see you in the next one